You guys, the hype for this is becoming way too much. I cannot contain my excitement. I'm not gonna be able to sleep tonight. The Behind the Sims Summit is officially tomorrow. It's less than 24 hours away now and things are happening things are happening like this i think is going to be even bigger than we're thinking like i know a lot of us think it's going to be the sims 5 which obviously is huge but then i think a lot of us have our doubts right like yes i'm like oh my god are they going to announce the sims 5 but then another part of me is like there's no freaking way there's no way they're going to announce it like it seems too good to be true and it could be something totally different but now i know 100 for a fact it has to be something huge because a part of me was worried that they're hyping this up, but then it's going to end up being something kind of like not as big as we're thinking. You know how they do that a lot? Like something will seem like it's going to be really exciting. They'll do a live stream and it's something that's kind of just like meh. Like, I don't know. I was really worried about that. And I know a lot of people are very nervous about that. I'm seeing a lot of people on Twitter saying that if it's not The Sims 5, the community is going to riot. And I definitely think that's going to happen. So I'm crossing my fingers that they're not setting themselves up for failure this time. And it's looking good, guys. I'm seriously not going to be able to sleep. Like I have been debating just staying up. I'm going to try to sleep. It's just, I don't know if I'm going to be able to. <laughs> So comment down below if you're in the same boat because when I'm excited like this, it is so hard to sleep. So The Sims did tweet today one more day until The Sims 4 base game goes free to play and the Behind The Sims Summit stream event at 10 a.m. PST on Sims YouTube, Twitch, and Steam. So they're also live streaming this on Steam, it looks like. I didn't know that. I'm just going to be watching it on YouTube. But yeah, they've been hyping this up every single day and then... A bunch of things happened that I did not expect. So you guys may have seen this, but Phoebe Robinson is actually going to be the host for this Sim Summit stream. So it just says here, you know, super excited to be hosting the Behind the Sim Summit stream. There is a video here, but I'm going to link everything. So go ahead and watch this. So you guys can hear what she says and everything. So definitely go to the link down below because I'm going to have everything linked there. And then, you know, watch these things, listen to what each person says, because you never know if there could be like a hint or like s a certain wording that they use could sometimes mean something. Just listen to the word she uses. I have seen some people like talking about it anyways. Then, okay, so this I was not expecting. So next kids makes a tweet, okay? This happened today, like not even long ago, just a couple hours ago. This is like, what? This is when I was like, okay, this is, this is huge. Like they would not be doing all this. Like what? I don't know if there's music. Like I think there is music in the background and then I think there's music at the end. I don't know if it's copyrighted. So I'm just gonna mute this. Um, so definitely Definitely go watch this yourself to listen to what's being said but what i just did not expect this like so a dance is being prepared and everything like what they're gonna be performing a whole dance i like did not you know when they first announced the sim summit stream i actually thought like when they first revealed this was gonna be happening and we didn't really know anything yet i obviously assumed that this was gonna be more of something where like they're just doing a stream in like the little room they usually do live streams in, right? Or sometimes they're even live streaming from home. But no guys, this is like, <laughs> we're having an actual event. That's why I'm like, okay, they can't be doing all this and not announcing like some other Sims game. Even if it's not The Sims 5, like some people were talking about like, oh my God, what if they make a Sims Online remake? Like separate Sims game. Back in The Sims 1 days, there was The Sims Online. And it's like, what if they bring something like that back? Or what if they do like um, another spinoff game? Like, I just feel like it has to be something big. I can't see them doing all this just for like an add-on in The Sims 4. That's one thing because I was like, what if this is just, you know, an expansion pack announcement, which would still be exciting, right? Like I, I've said before, like if it's just a big announcement for The Sims 4, that's fine too. I would think if it's just a Sims 4, I mean, first of all, they did say, I think they're also talking about The Sims Mobile and stuff, not just The Sims 4, but regardless, when it comes to The Sims 4 info, I can't see it just being all that. Like I can't, I don't know. I can't see them making this big of a deal for just something big in The Sims 4. Like, it's got to be more than that. Obviously, the base game's going free, so they're going to be talking about that. But, like, they're really celebrating. There's got to be something else going on here, like, 100%. I don't know. Like, we've seen the way they announce expansion packs before, and it's usually not like this. Like, I know they've have, they have, they literally have announced expansion packs at, like, EA Play and stuff, but that's because, like, EA Play is happening when, you know, an expansion pack is coming. So, you know what I mean? Like, this is literally an entire event for the sims like this is 
like wow and then not only that then kelsey tweeted you guys probably are familiar with her she has awesome let's plays again i'm just gonna mute this so please go watch it and like listen to what she's talking about and everything it's like a little like get ready with her and then they, yeah so they invited her and she's getting to you know be a part of this and do interviews and stuff and like look where she is like this is just so cool so yeah go give that a listen like I said, all the links will be in the link below. This was also just very recently, like when I'm filming this, it was only like an hour or so ago. So this is so exciting. I'm going to try to get this video up as fast as possible. What are you guys thinking? Are you nervous? Are you excited? I'm nerve sighted. I am like so excited and so nervous all at the same time. I have never been this impatient for a live stream in my entire life, I feel like. I remember like back in The Sims 3 days, I would be so impatient for certain packs to release. Like I would get this like, I don't know. They used to call it like pre-expansion pack syndrome. That was like a term that everyone would say. <laughs> and that would happen to me so bad with The Sims 3 when a new pack was going to release. And I mean, I still get that feeling when there's going to be a Sims 4 expansion pack, but it's not the same. It's not the same for certain expansion packs. Yeah, like seasons and stuff. But like this, I'm getting that same feeling for sims as i did with sims 3 packs and like maybe even more like i am hyped to the next level and at this point it's like i'm just so hyped because i'm like what are they gonna announce it's not even like i'm like sims 5 sims 5 sims 5 like obviously yeah i'm hopeful for that but now i'm just like what is it like i have pure excitement just wondering what the hell they're gonna announce because it's like who knows at this point like who knows what is going on i don't know i'm really surprised there hasn't been any leaks which also makes me think, you know, it's not really going to be entirely something big for The Sims 4. Like, I think it's going to be something else, whether that's Sims 5, a spinoff game. I don't know. I just think it's going to be something else because I think otherwise, for some reason, I just think there would have been a leak because every single time there's going to be this big announcement for The Sims 4, it always gets leaked. And that hasn't happened. And to me, that's like shocking. I actually, I'm really hoping there's not a leak from now until the live stream because that would be really sad. Um, but yeah, something just makes me think that there's not a leak happening because it's something that truly no one knows about. You know what I mean? Like there's, I just feel like there's no way to leak it. Now I will say there was leaks for two kits. It was just the icons of them. There's like, um, a coffee icon and then a strawberry. I have no idea what the strawberry would mean, <laughs> but I think it'd be cute. I don't know. I'm not really a kids person, so I don't know, but the icons look cute. So like, you know, maybe it'll actually be some exciting kids. Who knows? So I'm assuming they're going to talk about that at this stream, but like, it's going to be more than that. Like, this is quite obvious now. There, there's, I'm sorry. There's no way they're literally inviting Kelsey and they're having next kids dance and like all this stuff is going on. And like Phoebe's the host, like there's just too much going on. <laughs> like, obviously it has to be important or like, why would all these people be willing to go, you know, attend this event and like do sim interviews and prepare a whole dance routine and like all this stuff. Like, I feel like it's got to be something really massive if that's the case. So anyways, I think that's all I wanted to talk about today. I don't know. My thoughts are going a mile a minute. So I apologize if this video is all over the place, but I just wanted to make one last video about this before the live stream. And I'm going to be watching the live stream on my TV. And then once it's done, I'm going to be making a video with whatever they talk about. So I'm not going to be live streaming or anything like that because I don't know. I'm the type of person I, I just need to watch it on my own first and like have my little own excitement. Like I, I want to like watch it the way you guys are watching it like I want that feeling and not like being a youtuber while I watch it like does that make sense like I, I just want that pure excitement off camera and then come and talk to you guys with all the excitement I mean hopefully I'm excited <laughs> but I'm assuming I will be so anyways I'm so pumped oh my god oh my god comment down below if you're gonna have trouble sleeping like me because you know uh-huh comment down below if you have a really hard time sleeping when you're excited about something no matter what it is especially when it seems related though I'm gonna keep waking up like I know I will sleep at some point, but I know that I'm going to keep waking up because my body's going to keep thinking it's time to get up and then I'll check the time and it'll be like five in the morning. <laughs> like I, I know that's going to happen. So anyways, you guys, let's go ahead and do our notification shout out. And this one goes to Ali. Oh, I'm so glad you found my channel. That really does mean a lot. Thank you so, so much for your comment. And if you guys want a chance to be in a notification shout out, all you got to do is comment down below. So I'm going to go ahead and wrap this up here. If you guys enjoyed, if you guys are all having an amazing, amazing day, and we're going to leave some positivity down below. I love you guys also so much and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. Then